Good evening, everyone. My name's Heath Haskins, Good Prime, and we're back in Lumber Tycoon 2. Sorry, that was a little quick. My name's Heath Haskins, Code Primate. We are back inside Lumber Tycoon 2. Sorry, I got a little excited there. Um, my wife couldn't finish her coffee, so I went ahead and downed her coffee, and I still have an entire cup of coffee on my own, so I've got a lot of coffee in me. It's just coffee, like, all night, so. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm. Anyhow, I'm back inside my private server with the two winners of the uh, the, the friendship egg, and then Mr. Slick Mills, the amazing builder, awesome lumber tycooner, and just all around nice guy. And we are going to be testing out some uh, like one more theory. Okay, so the glitch, you guys have like been all over this glitch, and one of the theories is can you transfer the power from a base that has the power to an existing base and not not buy a new one? All right, guys, let's go trolling while we can. <sighs> <laughs> I'm watching you. <laughs> Anyhow, before we get started, I got fan mail. Uh, cover up that address. Yay! Thank you so much. Oh my goodness. There we go. There. And um, it came in the mail on Friday, but I didn't read it Friday, Saturday, so tonight is Sunday night. I'm going to be reading it. <clears throat> and it says, subscribe to Code Primate and you drew me a little... A little uh, snowman thingy with it. He's got a little axe and it's snowing. I love this. I'm actually going to hang this up inside my office. And it says, Dear Code Primate, my name is Gavin. I am 11 years old. I love your videos and I think they are the greatest content on YouTube. When I played with you on New Year's Eve, I thought it was so cool that the OK symbol on right, that is on my Roblox shirt that you talked about. Yes, I, I remember it. It's not the OK symbol, it's the, the um, it's the game where you make this, this symbol and you try and get people to look at it. And if they look at it, you get to punch them in the arm. But don't punch, okay? This, that's like the old school, like 1990s version. And if you think that's a new game, it's been around since I was a kid. Um, anyhow, <laughs> where were we at? Okay, uh, that is on my Roblox t-shirt uh, that you talked about. That has been banned from my school. I asked for a shirt that had the OK symbol on it, but since it was banned from my school, I couldn't get it. I was really wondering if I could if I could have an autograph and if I could be in a collab on my Roblox username is creeperboy5593. Oh, I can't read it. Oh, it's too tiny. 55 five something. Um Discord is Something, I think it's heck, H E C number 5078. Sincerely, Creeper Boy. P.S. I hope you like my drawing. P.P.S. I love your videos. P.P.P.S. Keep doing what you do. Gavin, thank you so much for your letter and your fan art. And you also sent me a, um, a return. Where did it go? There's a return envelope around here somewhere. Um, look, uh, thank you. <laughs> I love that you're a huge fan of me and everything else. By the way, I noticed that you're actually in the same like close place location as me. Oh my gosh. So, um, yes, uh, I will try and get something signed and send it back to you. Um, uh, I don't know about the collaboration. I'd have to look at your YouTube channel first. Um, just make sure that you don't have any like crazy content out there because that's what I do Like I, I, I like even if um, PewDiePie were to come to me and be like dude, we need to collab sometime. I'd be like yeah, I'm not sure about that um, Not because of who PewDiePie is as a person because I like I'm subscribed to PewDiePie I follow him, but at the same time. I don't want to I wouldn't want a five-year-old to nine-year-old, no pun intended, following, like, coming to my channel and being like, subscribe to PewDiePie. That's just not, that's not how, that I wouldn't want that for my kids. Do you see what I'm saying? So that's why I check on everybody's content. That's why I check to make sure that you're family friendly, that you're over the age 13, stuff like that, before I even consider, like, um, different collaborations. And for the most part, my collaborations are completely random. People who don't ask for them are usually the ones that get them. And they're surprised. They're like, what? You want to collab with me? Yes, yes, totally. So, anyhow, um, the idea behind Gavin, thank you once again. Huge shout out to Gavin, um, Creeper Boy. 
I can't, I, can't, I don't know the numbers. Uh, Creeper Boy, if you're watching the video, comment down below what your actual name is uh, in text, and then that way um, everybody go subscribe to uh, that comment down there. Who are Creeper Boy? There we go. That's covered, right? Okay. Um, so here's the next theory amongst the scholars and most Robloxian achievers. Uh, can you take the power and transfer it to a base that doesn't have the power by loading in a base that has the power first and then loading in the other base that doesn't have the power? Whew. All right, that's a mouthful. So we need to load. I'm just going to load in base six because we know that I've got the power on this one. I've bought it three times. So code, can I teach you a trick? Nope. <laughs> Sorry. We got to move. Uh, one light, one TNT, uh, and one long plank, please. One, one light, one work light. Wow. Can't say one work light. Elite. It's a work leet. It leet. It's a elite. Elite light. <laughs> light. Light. <laughs> I didn't realize it like all the different ways that you can spell light. Mm. I got the plank. Glorious. <clears throat> Hopefully this will. All right. Slick Mills, you need to back it up, dude. Back it up, back it up, back it up, back it up, back, 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 back up. Back up, quick. <laughs> back up. Back. B hack up. Oh no. <laughs> no. Oh, oh no. Oh no. <laughs> okay, it's kind of funny. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, by the way, you might have noticed that the, the, the art's not done. And it's because of this wood right here. I was silly. This is not um, this is not walnut wood. I went and got walnut wood and, and I compared its colors and I'm like, oh yeah, that's koa. That's the big koa trees overseas. And I don't have a gingerbread axe. I, mean, I didn't, but now that I've mentioned it into a video, there's probably going to be a ton of them. Maybe. Possibly. I don't want to assume. So, I'll just wait. It's tough because it's night time. For no, Bob's Shack doesn't require it to be night. Um, the light you can purchase from over there, and long planking doesn't take anything. So, I mean, you can do it at any time. <laughs> Ooh, idea. Hold up. Come here, ducky. Come here, duck. All right, hold on. Let's. Stick a duck right there. <laughs> this is gonna be awesome. Hold on. It's a Fourth of the Fourth of July duck explosions extravaganza. Hold on, hold on. I gotta get this little bit. Can we tilt that? There we go. Oh, oh, oh! They want to fall down, don't they? All right, hold on. Maybe if we stick them upright like that and sideways. There we go. That'll touch. That'll that'll work. <laughs> Video gets demonetized for saying quack. <laughs> okay, hold on. Oh, oh, just there. That's fine. Quack. <laughs> That's cool, you know. Ideas behind things. Okay, here we go. I'm going to load in the uh, the second non-power base. So just to prove that I've got the power here, we're going to do um, large floor like this, right over there, like that. And then we're just going to move this in like that. That probably wasn't very convincing because that could have been a really big piece on the floor. So let's uh, let's do it again. And let's get just a single slice of wood here. There we go. Uh-oh, what happened? 
destroy that. All right, try this again. Large floor, on there, good. Hit B, drop one, and boom. All right, so this one's got the power. Destroyed, menu, load. What is slot four? I don't remember why. Okay. Loading in slot four. If, if this is going to... Grammar. Jam, jammed, but... <clears throat> I cannot remember what slot four is. Um... There was, like... Hold on. There used to only be five slots, right? Oh, I can't remember what slot four is. Is slot four the... Um... One plot? I had a one plot at one time, didn't I? I can't remember. Oh gosh, oh gosh, this is gonna be embarrassing, especially if it's something I don't want you guys to see. Oh, I'm just kidding. There's nothing that I'm embarrassed about. Code, watch, wake up buddy. I'm, I'm woken, I'm woke. I'm shook. <laughs> I don't know what that means. Is that what you kids are talking about on the internet nowadays? Shook. Come on, come on. <sighs> I saw um, a lot of people responding to um, a video or a news thing. It was a new newscast. There was, I think it was a Native American who was either attacked or walked up to some kind of protest that was going on and the protest these um, protesters were like screaming in his face and like I don't know what the whole story is okay and I'm not gonna take it aside on anything but there's been a huge huge response to it from both sides from saying so much as like you didn't see the whole video you didn't see what the old man was doing yes this is my one plot build okay so I truly I do not know what the story is however I do know that neither side was right in the situation um, in America in this country you're allowed to protest, okay? And you're allowed to speak your opinion. You're allowed to say basically anything you want. Even slander, even mudslinging, even everything that you want. And if you don't think that's true, just look at the politicians who go up for elections and start talking smack against each other. These are not good examples. These are not people that I want my children being influenced by. Uh, and I sure don't want any of you guys to be influenced by it. So anything that you're seeing on Twitter, on YouTube, on doesn't matter. Okay. Even if it's CNN trying to, to cast it, I want you to know that the point of view that you're being fed is not the point of view that you should be taken into. You should definitely be making your own decisions about what the situation totally is and what you feel is right. Now I feel that both sides were absolutely wrong because no one should physically touch anyone else no matter what the situation you should never you have no right to place your hands on another human being the only time that I feel that somebody should do that is to prevent someone from hurting someone else or to prevent them from hurting themselves this ideal idea comes from when I worked in corrections and it's it's a big one for me because I mean I would have inmates who would just yell and scream and call me all kinds of names okay cool mm -hmm. bring it you can say whatever you want okay it's not going to affect me it's in the end I'm still going to be okay <sighs> but when somebody reaches out and physically slaps something out of your you've crossed a line you have now committed assault and i don't think it's right so keep your hands to yourself if you're the person that's swinging hitting and i know that i just showed a video of my daughter swinging at my son and smacking the camera 
out of his hands. <clears throat> not, not going to lie, that was, uh, that was mean. But, she got in trouble for it. And I believe she should be in trouble for it. Okay, sorry. We are getting totally distracted by <laughs> being a nice guy, Code. Wait, is that it? Is that the piece right there? That's the piece. Alright. Peace les resistance. So, here's my one by one. There is the blueprint. 4%. 4%. Ta-da! Okay. So, let's move this over to here. We have our two pieces. And we'll take a gander just under here. If you look, this is the green. Um, where, wait, I gotta, I gotta have... Excuse me. Excuse me. Just chop this little piece off right here. Okay, so the way that you can tell if a base has the power is the comparison of the plot color to a piece of um, oak wood. Okay? Just take a piece of oak wood, set it down on the slot, and if it looks brown compared to green, then that base has the power. Now, let's, uh... Hi, hi buddy! Let's head... Oh, gosh. Hold on. Actually, here. I've got a car. I've got cars. I can do cars. Watch your face, buddy! Come on, Jingle! Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. You guys coming? <clears throat> Never mind, kind of forgot I live in a place with no windows. Wait, what? Uh, uno momento, por favor. One minute, please. Alright, so uh, let's drive over to a slot that's not been loaded in, because I'm pretty sure everybody here has the power. But this one right here, okay? I'm just showing like before. This one. Boom. Same, same colors. Like, the only difference is the shadows. Right? Literally, that little piece of wood, like, disappears. That's how you can tell somebody does not have the power. Okay? So, let's go. Let's roll. Are we heading over there? Yes, we are. <laughs> yes. It's go time. Oh gosh, oh gosh. You guys had like 18 minutes. Could have had everything set up. The rock blasted. Path for me to straight through. <laughs> it's kind of like when people are like, okay, whenever I go around actually signing bases, like when I have time, um, a lot of people will sit there and just, all right. So we got, okay, got TNT. Got light. Where's the long plank? Where's the long plank? Dude. Dude. <laughs> you had one job. <laughs> Joking. <laughs> Oh gosh. Now I feel feels bad. <laughs> I wanna try something. Just just out of curiosity. I wonder. I wonder. Oh gosh. Oh stop, stop, stop. No, don't do that. No. Here. Let's set this set this down like this. And uh oh. <laughs> Hold on. Maybe I can do it with this one. <laughs> it, it it registers. That's not gonna work. Come on, lift. Oh. Lift. Uh, 
Where's this long plank? All right, you know what? I gotta go get it. <laughs> Here it comes. Uh, is it big enough? Enough? Is it big enough? Enough? Yeah, it should be fine. We're good. If you look at the comparison of the, uh, yeah, we are good. All right. Long planks. Oh, oh, here. I should grab. Shall I do the long plank part? It's kind of, kind of my thing. Wait. Wait. You're good. You are goods. Oh, oh, oh. By the way, this is not my plank. And these are not my lights. That's why it's, uh, a little bit more glitchy. Uh oh. Click, grab. One at a time, one at a time. Guys, guys. You know the plank rules. One at a time. Always has been and always will be one at a time. <laughs> I blame Ethel. <laughs> it's like, I blame you. Don't blame Ethel. Not his fault. Yeah, ethereal or enlightened? I should just say enlightened. I'll call you intro. No, because then it sounds like entrails. Ew. There's one. Upsy daisy. You got it. Alrighty then. There you Oh, oh, oh. Easy. There you go. Not gonna be able to grab it if you leave it there. Just scooch forward a little bit. Scooch forward. Um. Scooch. Scooch forward. Just a little. Boom is in the position. Uh, ethereal. Commence with boom. We are in route. Yep, yep, that's good. That's good. Don't jump. <clears throat> Second rule of rule of long planking. Don't jump. <laughs> Come on, guys. You know the rules. Like the plank has got to be yours. Uh, one at a time when walking up. Can't go more than eight degrees angle. And then, uh, don't jump whenever you're going up. Like, if you do jump, you have to jump and then go forward and then walk. There you go. Careful. Careful. You got it. You got it. If you do jump, it has to be uh, jump, 
move land. Here, I'll get this over there. A little bit less laggy for me. We can go ahead and open it up, I think. Uh, it still doesn't count as mine, does it? I think it still counts as the person who, who had it. Here we go. Uh, we are at 25 minutes. 25 minutes remaining. Or 5 minutes remaining. <laughs> Blink. What in the world? Let go. Now I can move. There it goes. Alright. May I take... Con oops. Take control of the plank. Can I take control? Can I take control? Can I take control of the maze and blank? Oh, sorry. Go ahead if you think you can do better, which is probably true. sure it's under my control which it still feels a little glitchy yep ooh it's not under my control okay yeah it is yeah it is that is a lot more stable than I thought it was going to be let that slide down like that Go. Push. Whoa. Push, 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 push. Okay. So, slice right here. We're only going to be taking off a unit at a time. Come on. Push again. Oh, oh, that's half unit. Basically, you just want to work it down until there you go. There, there, there it goes. And down we go. And now, this should be just the right size. Uh, did the darkness not turn on? That's crazy, because I can still see. Whoa, 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 whoa. It's a little unstable, a little unstable. <laughs> I'm like, where did it go, George? Where did it go? <laughs> I feel the wand. Belongs to another. It does not answer to me. <laughs> no more changing of the ownership.
Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. See, that looks a lot more smooth when he does it. I don't think the transfer of ownership came to me. I think it's still his. There we go. We can adjust. That's okay. Oops, sorry. <laughs> I can kind of do this without um without light. Just so you guys know. I've got no light though. <laughs> Should I just try and do this on my own? Okay, let's do this. Okay, I'm totally walking the, the length in complete darkness. Turn to the left, to the right. Lefty righty roo. I am lost. I'm lost and I can't see anything. Oh no. Alright, let's go to um Roblox game. Turn on those filters. Here we go. We got some filters. But I still I don't see anything. Oh gosh, I am completely blind. Oh gosh. Wow. That's like super dark. <laughs> Chat. <gasps> no, no. Does not work. Nope. He's like, oof. <laughs> uh, I wish for this. Fool, return when you have sufficient funds. Uh, do you want to buy extra money? Let's go to the menu. Uh, you know. To... Okay, Google. What is 10 million divided by 20,000? Okay, Google. What is 500 times 1,799? The answer is 899,500. You would have to have 80, 899,500 Robux just to get close to 10 million in-game bucks. Oh my. So when people come around to you and ask, can I have money? Please be aware of the actual extent of what it is. Yeah, boy has to go save more children's coffee mugs to reports the, what? 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 Anywho, that concludes this print, this, uh, this glitch, um, test of the emergency broadcast system. No. <laughs> so. Um, what I would have to do is, let's see, I would have to load in a base that already has something on it, delete that base, and then purchase property, and then come back up here, and that would work. That's apparently how the glitch works, so. Thank you everyone for watching this episode of Lumber Tycoon 2 with me, Heath Haskins. Code Primate, we are missing somebody. There's four standing there, but we need one more. Where is the last one? Uh, hold on, we got Slick. Jingle? Where are you? Where are you, Jingle? Jingle, Jingle? Still working on getting up there. He got left behind by us. <gasps> no one gets left behind. No one is forgotten. <laughs> You know better than that.
<laughs> That's close. Come on. He can make it. We're at 35 minutes. I can I can spend some extra time so we can get up here and take the screenshot with us. Alright, come on, buddy. There you go. Jump, 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 jump. Oh, oh. Oh. Yeah. Go. Go. Grab. <laughs> that's like the normal skills, that's that's what you do. There we go. And now we're all back. Okay, so we found how how to. Uh, I, I think I can finally put this glitch to rest. Um, it yes, it does work with a new slot where you buy the base and all that good stuff. But if you come in on an existing base after loading in a base that already has it, it does require that you purchase it again. So unless you're willing to wipe a base to put the power on it, which in most cases, like if you have some slots hanging out there, go put the power on it. That yes, do that. But other than that, thank you everyone for watching this episode of Lumber Tycoon 2 with me, Heath Haskins, Code Primate. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe down below, do all those sprint screen good things that I'm supposed to call out at the end. But remember, in the end, it's really your choice. I love you guys either way. If you just want to stay here and watch, that's awesome. If you want to participate and comment and like and do all those other things, that is your choice. You have that. I love you guys very much. Have a great night. And we'll talk to you very soon. And um, I'm going to do this in a little bit different order. I'm gonna say outro, but I'm not gonna play the uh, the song. I'm gonna I'm gonna do the Hello Juniper thing because I don't know if anybody knows that there's a Hello Juniper that runs. Um, because my guy stands there, he looks left, he looks right, and then he fades out, and then I play the Hello Juniper. So we're gonna do Hello Juniper and then the outro. So if you're wanting to dance and you want the awesome song, you gotta stick through the uh, the Hello Juniper thing first. So here we go. <laughs>